Hello and welcome back to my channel. On today's makeup video, we are going to review the Jeffree Star products that I got um, on Black Friday that took me all the way until January to get. I was really upset about it, but it's been a few weeks. I have been able to um, test them out to see how I like them and I thought we would jump in and we would talk about the products that I bought. Okay guys. So I have the box right here. Um, can I just say I love how well Jeffree Star packages his things. I always think it's the sweetest thing. Like, um, I love, I save the tissue paper so I can show you guys. I like this tissue paper and this, I'm actually gonna see if I can't hodgepodge something together with this because I think this tissue paper is just stunning. And I love when he does stuff like this. Isn't that really, really pretty? I mean, it's just, it's impressive to me. All right, so I bought a couple of things on the Black Friday sale. I couldn't get everything I wanted because some of the stuff was sold out. But I was able to get a few things that I wanted. I will be picking up the other palette that I want very, very soon. But the first thing I got was the um, Northern Lights palette. It is absolutely stunning. And I should not be surprised. It always, always, always stuns me when Jeffree Star, when I get a Jeffree Star package and it's something that I wasn't expecting. I was expecting a highlighter palette like, hang on. Like this, like my ABH. It's thin, it's cardboard. Looks like this. I was expecting something like this. Now, for the sustainability, yeah, I, I'm kind of like, do we really need this much packaging? But the person in me that's a packaging hoa, and it is cardboard, so it's not like it's the end of the world. It's not like it's plastic, so I can work with that. But oh my god, it's so pretty and it's so thick. And I could travel with it. I don't think I'd have to worry about it being broken, which I absolutely freaking love. And then when I open it up, it is just stunning. Stunning, 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 just stunning. Um, I just, his packaging never ceases to amaze. Um, now we're going to talk about some parts of it that I don't like. It's really, really dusty. When I go to use it, I end up having to take my brush around the edges of it to try and collect products because I hate when product ends up everywhere. And you can actually see where it's a little bit dusty there. And that is disappointing. Um, the other thing I don't like is it is really, really glittery. When I wear it out in public by the end of the day, after three or four hours, it does look like a glitter bomb exploded on my face. And I'm not the biggest fan of that. So this isn't something I would choose for like a long wear all day thing. But it has been what I've been wearing in majority of my videos lately because the highlight is there. It's blinding. It's super pretty. It's just amazeballs in that department. And if you're looking for a super blinding highlight and you don't mind like a glitter flex that, that, that go around, then this is definitely a palette I would consider. Like I said, that's my biggest complaint about it. Just fell on the floor. Now, I also got um, No Tea No Shade in the liquid lipstick. I haven't worn this yet. I did swatch it. It's the only one I haven't worn. But um, I know Jeffree Star lipsticks, so I know it's going to be good. It's such a beautiful color. It's like that. And it's just absolutely freaking stunning. I'm going to swatch it for you here. Okay. It's just like this deep purpley vampy color that is gorgeous. Um, it is absolutely freaking stunning. Stunning. All right. I have worn this color in a lot of my videos. Um, if you watched my um, trolling of the NIFB, it is Strawberry Crush. It's like this. I love Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. I think that they are amazing. I think they are long wearing. They are comfortable. They are to die for. And this is a very bright pink, which is right up my alley. I know those are like on two totally different shade ranges, but... I really, 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 really love Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. I don't know if you can see in the background here, but I've got a whole like Jeffree Star liquid lipstick collection going on because I keep picking up shades. Then we have the main dish, as I like to call it, which is da -da -da -da, the Jeffree Star Blue Blood Palette. Oh my God. Okay, so I got the ColourPop. Um, I forgot what the ColourPop one is called, but I got the ColourPop Blue Palette. Blue Moon, I think. And I love that palette. I think it's gorgeous. I love making looks with it. Um, and I got it in lieu of this because I was afraid of the allergic reaction I would have. But after trying the Jawbreaker and the um, Shane Dawson one, Conspiracy, I realized Shadows probably are not going to do that to me. And 
I really wanted this bad boy and I bought it and oh my god first off the packaging can we just can we just talk about the packaging the packaging the packaging the packaging oh it's so pretty it's just mm. and then when you open it up oh my god okay so um, I've been wearing this for blue looks. There's, you can see there's been a couple of videos. There was a videos I made yesterday where I wore it. And then there were the NIFB videos where I wore it. And it looks stunning. And when I go out in it, like when I wear this out, I get some people will stop me and be like, your eyeshadow looks amazing. Your eyes look so pretty. They pop in that color. What are you using? I get so many compliments on the blue shades in here. And it's just amazing. Like um, one of my favorite shades to pop on the lid is this one right here which is um, entitled, and it looks like, I just got that lipstick all over. It looks like I pooed myself. It looks like that, and it is just absolutely stunning in the eye. Oh, yes, and then this one, which is Ice Tray, is so freaking pretty too. I mean, I wore that the other day. Those are like the two I wore in two different videos. Um, this one I haven't worn yet, but I think is a great highlighter shade or is going to make a great highlighter shade in the inner corner. I mean, oh, and that one is Cullinan. I mean, they're just, and I love the individual like stamps. I guess one of my favorite things about Jeffree Star palettes is the individual like stamps. I think that's just such a neat personal touch. Um, I love the packaging. Love, 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 love the quality of his eyeshadows. Um, I think if you're looking for a high quality, good palette that is blue, this is definitely something you should pick up. I still stand by my love of the ColourPop palette because it is good as well, but mama like, mama wanna keep. Mama is very, very happy with this. Okay, so that was my Jeffree Star order. Um, wasn't very much. But I did get a chance to use them. I really did like them. I will be getting the um, blood sugar very soon. I was waiting for it to come back into stock. It is now back in stock, I believe. I also think the peg mirror is back in stock. So I think I'm going to make that order in the next couple of days. And I will tell you what I think about that. But that was my Jeffree Star review. And I will see y'all later.